What's up, guys? <clears throat> Good morning. Hope you guys are having a beautiful day. I know I was. It was a good night. As you can tell from the videos before, I had a bunch of people. I stayed at the shelter, uh, staying, staying in Indian shelter. I had a bunch of people there last night. A bunch of people hanging around the fire pit and talking. And then probably about eight, nine o'clock, everybody was getting in their tents, ready for bed. But there was probably like 10, 15 people there. And when I woke up, I woke up at like seven o'clock, wasn't too early. But uh, by the time I woke up, there was only two people left at the freaking shelter. Camping with some early birds, man. Ready to get out on the trail. Me, personally, I like to have a coffee, sit there, have my breakfast, think about today, what I'm gonna do, which is walk. That's all I do every day, just walk. How hard is that? Why the fuck you gotta get up at five o'clock in the morning to walk? Got all fucking day. <laughs> Just my opinion. But uh, got about a five mile uphill and then downhill over standing Indian mountain. So it's gonna be about two, two and a half miles going just a gradual up, and then two, two and a half miles on a gradual down. I don't see the camera focusing on that. The sun's too bright. It's a pretty good view. But... Yeah, so two, two and a half miles downhill going to make it to uh, Betty Creek Camp. There's that breakfast. Betty Creek Camp tonight, hopefully. It's supposed to be getting some rain tonight. Probably not till about 11, 12 o'clock. So it won't be till later. Won't have to walk in it or anything. It's supposed to be pretty warm with the humidity going up supposed to be pretty nice but uh, North Carolina sure looks a lot like Georgia to me <laughs> but I'm sure that'll change further north we go so that's the plan for today get up over this mountain the two two and a half miles downhill sucker on the knees man but yeah we will see you guys at the top peace all right guys getting to the tippy top of standing Indian mountain 5,435 feet Highest point I've been on the trail so far. And it does not disappoint. Holy shit. That is one hell of a view. You guys want to see it? Huh? You guys want to see this?
What's up, guys? Currently going up Albert Mountain, up to the Albert Mountain Fire Tower, which is right there. I can see it. But this trail, look at this. There's the white blaze right there. Goes up along here. And look at next one, way up there. They don't even got them, the white blazes on trees anymore. They gotta use the rocks. This is pretty gnarly. Shit. Drop that. See the white blaze? Whoop, right there. Gotta go up that way. This has been, this whole trail getting up this mountain has been pretty crazy. There was a part where I felt like I was in the, the, the jungle, just like a path along a, a mountain. Good on this side, steep as fuck on that side. I gotta let you go, guys. I'll see you at the top. It's too hard to hold the camera. Here we are on top of the fire station, fire tower, way up there. It's supposed to be getting some rain tonight, so it looks like the clouds are coming in. Right here it is, North Carolina. So beautiful. But you want to know the best thing about this is? We hit another marker today. Bam, son. 100 miles. Only 2,100 to go. <laughs> uh, but that's not bad. What was it? This is day 11. Got 100 miles done. I was taking it pretty easy last week, so we got this, guys. It's going to be an epic adventure. Just you wait. See ya.